What's up, everybody? My name is Lei Hua, and welcome to the Superfina channel. I am a Hawaii variety content creator, host of podcast Cross Worlds, and I stream on twitch.tv slash Lei Hua Superfina. Today, we are reacting to Banish from the Heroes Party. And if you like anime reactions, don't forget to subscribe, ring the bell, so you'll be notified on the next upload. And if you'd like to support the channel, we got channel membership, Patreon, and merchandise. Link to those are below. We are reacting to Banish from the Heroes Party, episode 6. We are halfway through the series. And... Gideon has not even met up with the other party members from the Heroes Party yet. Like, they've been building that up and they still haven't crossed over yet. It's like, are we ever going to see them link back together ever again? Like, I don't think so. I don't think we're ever going to see. Them. I think we're just going to see them, like, reminiscing, talking about each other and such. But... Never cross a path. I don't think so. If you think they're going to cross paths, put them in the comments. Say that you think they are. If you don't think they're going to cross paths, say, I don't think so. Yeah, it's not going to happen. Nope. Well, nope. We're going to have to see that in another season. But besides that, let's watch this episode. Dr. Newman's Clinic. He feels my order to a T. Mm-hmm. I'm pretty sure those needles are hard to come by after that fire. The rampage begins. Hey, you okay in there? Rampage. Yo, that guy looks like he got... <gasps> he just get doped. Look at that. Substance. Rampage. Substances. Mm-hmm, this is going to be about that drug that got approved and being abused. Remember that drug? The one that made that merchant guild thingamajiggy not give Gideon, or Red, Red a pass? The one that started making it, having him have a hard time? Mm-hmm. The rampage. I'm assuming we're going to see people affected by the substance in this episode. Like, we already see it, but I think we're going to see more. Like, it's going to be a bigger problem. Narcotic. Recently approved medicine. Mm-hmm, you're going to see a lot more patients like this. He's like, red, stock up. <laughs> she has such, like, a upset face. And then she's like, I want an omelet. I've seen how these omelets are made, and I'm still amazed. Like, there's no way I can make an omelet like that. Like, first of all, making the scrambled eggs that thin. Like, I don't know if I can do that, yo. And if I have, like, something with fried rice, I would want that grandma part to be a little wet. You know what I mean? Wet and fluffy. But anyways, that was such a dangerous drug. Let's not talk about eggs. Let's talk about this distribution of this dangerous drug. Let's go have some fun by the river. <gasps> we can have a barbecue and go swimming. Yo, Gideon, are you asking her out on a date? Rawr. Should we call him Gideon or should we call him Red? 
I feel like we're supposed to call him Red if we're talking about his life now. I like to call him Gideon when it's involving the hero's party. I would like to call him Red in this. Ooh, they got two bottles of something cooling it off in the river. Look at that. Red is wearing shorts. Oh, she's got her bathing suit underneath. Oh, look at her, you know, sticking off her top, letting her just jiggle in front of him. She's keeping with the red theme. Look at red staring at her. <gasps> look at that blush. That blush. She was trying to act all cool when she was taking off her clothes. They make a really good couple. They would make really cute babies. Can you imagine them having a kid with his dark hair, her bluish green eyes, two eyes, whatever color they are? I thought you'd be used to this sort of thing. Yeah, because she's so forward. Girl, you got courage. See, he says you're pretty forward. What if he rejects me? What if he's forgotten me? He was so nervous. Thought you'd be more used to this sort of thing? What do you mean? I try my hardest to get your attention, but you never bat a lash. Like you see me as a little girl who's out of her league. He had his sister in mind. Like he was focused on his sister. I didn't want to call him up as lovesick or desperate. Oh, he was being shy and he's admitting to it. Well, look at her. She's turning red on her shoulders, on top of her chest, on her knees. This, the <gasps> she wants him to be that much closer. Get some more. Make your bond stronger. <laughs> How far do you think they went? I think they kept that kissing. I think they're going to peace themselves in this relationship. They really are. Might, might as well keep up with that pace, you know? I'm still surprised that Aries is still being so haughty. Especially after... Ruti like punched a hole in him. You would think he would be more cautious or a little bit more apprehensive about doing things right. Oh, they were going to talk about the hero's blessings. Resist to sleep. Don't need sleep. Never feel tired. Never need to eat. Girl, you got resistance to everything. Never feel refreshed or uncomfortable. The value and blessing of the hero demands I be the hero. Unnecessary emotion. Oh, so that's why she has like a stone face. Not because she's emotionally detached, because of her hero's blessing. That means she can't go after her brother. She wants to go after her brother, but she can't go after her brother. Yeah, the antidote for the narcotic. 
use of the drug is pretty based on what adventures are saying. Makes you feel like a new person. I wonder what's being used for that drug yet though. Will it be related to the demon lord? Rah. Red's shop is kind of out of the way. You ran all the way to his shop, probably because he knew that there is like medic stuff over there. See, look at her. She's running down the hill. Red's shop is up a freaking hill. It's out of the way. Oh, member of Albert's party. Are we surprised that Albert's party's making trouble again? Are we surprised? No, not really. First of all, why is he using this drug in the first place? Is he using the drug because Albert told him to use it? Or did he start using it because he felt like he needed to meet up to Albert's level? Dang, Rit! She was like, boom, boom, pow! She was one-shotting his people! And that person one-shotted the others with his crossbow. Remember my father caused you so much trouble. Why'd you kill them? We need to interrogate them. We need to know where they got the drug. I feel like Albert is covering something. <laughs> Your fiance. What a tool. Ugh. Don't mind me, she says. Little ritual thing she does to keep from killing. Her blessing gives her such an urge. This is how she squashes it. Yes, Abba, be scared. Be scared. Paper doesn't say who did the autopsy. The paper is hiding something. Yeah, Campbell, if he's a if he has a thieves blessing, he wouldn't use an axe. I want to sleep just like this. Rit is like, I don't wanna get involved. I just wanna have my slow life with my man. One day I had an urge for pasta, but I wanted shrimp with it, and I cooked shrimp with it, but the shrimp was like super fishy, and I was like, eh. So I looked up how to take out the fishy taste, and it said you need to soak it in milk. Ew, how she's asking for a second so the kids would be comfortable about eating just one plate, and then they will feel comfortable about asking for seconds. Yeah, that person's blessings is a weapon master. They can master any weapon. But can't it be like anything though? Can't they just master any tool? Because, you know, a fork could be a weapon. <laughs> I'm just saying. <laughs> 
What if they can make anything into a weapon? Make a chair into a weapon. Whack, whack, whack. Warrior is the most mundane blessing of all. Yikes. Well, in some MMORPGs, isn't a warrior like one of the like um I don't want to say the easiest class to get, but it's one of the foundations I want to say. First tier. How about that? It's the first tier. These people with our names. Rit, Red, Ruti, Ria. I wouldn't be surprised if the next episode we meet someone with another our aim. Our aim? Our name. I think Albert is taking on more quests to help hope with what happened with that incident. Seems irritated that we can't live up to his expectations. Albert has the blessing of the champion, which allows him to overcome obstacles and perform great feats. It drives him to show the world his power and leave his mark upon history. Well, dang, no wonder he feels frustrated, failed to harness it, though, and ended up out here in the sticks. How do you fail to harness that? He act like Drek, but he's trying to be the champion of here. Oh. Red is being so nice. I think Red would be a really good coach, like guiding people to flourish with their blessing. Whoa! Did his eyes glow to assess this person? You seem formidable. Who are you? My name is Bui. You're good looking. Suspicious. Very suspicious. One, you were wearing a cloak. Two, you're good looking. <laughs> Three, you're looking for Gideon. You know, Gideon was like a, was a, was a character of the shadows, right? Even though he was like a leader, he was a guide, he wasn't in the spotlight like the other members of the hero's party. So to know who Gideon is, hmm, suspicious. And look, they talked about warm milk with honey, brought back to the sister, now we have a flashback. About the storm or the thunder? Or about the building possibly collapsing and crushing everyone to death? <laughs> oh dang, this is a little kid that said that. Sheesh kebab. Aww. Gideon's like, I'm scared. Hold my hand. Is he bringing out the compassion out of her? 
Oh. Sorry, I wasn't really scared. I just wanted to hold your hand. But people do plenty of things for no reason. If you ever want to hold my hand for no reason, just let me know. Oh, she do love. Does she still love her brother? Oh, sibling love, it's beautiful. <laughs> She's like, I smiled. <laughs> Very interesting. It looks like he's teaching her about what makes you feel happy, makes you feel love. Aww. She's like, I want to hug you now. Oh, she wanted him to stay with him forever. Forever. Ever anything you don't want to do, just let me know. Wow. I feel like this is going to be like a foreshadow. Hmm. Yo, isn't that the kid? That's supposed to have the blessing of a weapons master? Yo! And that's my reaction to Vanish from the Heroes Party Episode 6. So, I feel like there's a lot of, like, foreshadowing for the rest of this season. Like, for example, the kid who doesn't want to, you know, embrace their blessing, weapons master. And then they showed that kid at the end of the episode. And then they talked about Albert, whose blessing is the champion, but he wasn't able to harness it very well. So he's now in the sticks. And um, they talked about Rudy, how she has the blessing of the hero, and it gives her all these blessings, but it also it's also making a negative impact on her. And then they show that, she loves her brother, but she's not supposed to have emotions because of the blessing. And she wants to be with her brother. She wanted to be with her brother forever. But Aries, you know, he interfered. Now they're separated. And Rudy, she wants to be with her brother, but she can't go to her brother. So she's letting someone else in the party go to her brother. And it's like, oh, wow. Like, there's a lot of building up leading to something i just don't know what it's gonna be like there's so many things that can be involved but for one thing there's a drug thing there's a drug okay i think that's going to be connected to the demon lords or whatever something with the desert like i think it's going to be connected to that and then there's that new character the one that's like oh you're looking for gideon too me too i'm looking for gideon let's go look for gideon together so shady but besides that what did you think about this episode? What did you think about this video? Let me know in the comments below. And if you want to talk outside of YouTube, there's a Discord. Link is in the description. I also stream on twitch.tv slash the host Super Fiend. Outside of YouTube and Twitch, I host podcasts across worlds where we talk about anime, manga, and other things you're interested in. If you like podcasts like that, link to podcasts is in the description. They're available on all platforms. Other than that, my name is Lehua, and this is the Super Fina channel reacting to Banished from the Heroes Party Episode 6. Hope you guys like this video and I'll see you in the next one. Laters!